Okay, this is Armand from VAC Motorsports. I want to show you something working on a four-wheel drive BMW E90 to 3 Series. So the front axle boots are torn. This is no surprise. Everyone sees this stuff. Um, so it needs that axle. Look over here. It needs this axle torn there, torn there. You see all the grease everywhere. Um, and and th then I'm a little concerned because the differential here, the gear that runs both axles, I'm a little concerned that might be bad. Now, one very important insight on these, if you ever do an axle, uh, when you pull that axle out, you're actually losing some fluid. A lot of guys don't know this. You're losing a decent amount of fluid for the differential. And if you don't bother refilling it, you're, you're probably gonna burn up the differential. Being that this car has these cheap aftermarket axles already gone, I'm concerned that ran low and maybe burned up internally as well. So now this becomes expensive. This guy came in with a four x four problem. And this is the transfer case back here. This is the transfer case. There's a front drive shaft that runs from there to the front differential. The differential s s sends power to the wheels. So this was getting expensive because his four x four lights are on. He needs the motor. We did the fluid in there and the fluid looked good, but he needs a motor. So between the motor and the axles and possible differential, you're like $3,500 or $4,000 or whatever, or more. We are now offering, because these cars are getting old, an option to delete or remove the four x four. All you're doing simply is you're gonna remove this dry shaft so it's no longer spinning. And then you're gonna remove the axles. But when you remove these, you have to leave that external hub in there. That's what's basically keeping the wheel bearing stable and then so you'll take same thing here remove the whole drive shaft you're going to leave the differential it's not going to do anything because it's not spinning anymore and if it's trash then it's trash fine so you'd same here you just leave that hub so you remove the axles you remove the drive shaft the, the front drive shaft and if there's a problem with the motor you don't even have to replace that you just have to program the car as a non four wheel drive car. And that's what we're gonna do here. All right, and um, this is a way to convert the car from a four wheel drive to a non four wheel drive and to keep the budget down. So let's say it's about $4,000, let's say to fix it properly and keep the car four wheel drive. This is gonna cost between labor and programming probably 1500 and the car will be actually better on gas and no more axle problems. Of course, no more four wheel drive either. Hopefully this helps.